This didn't make much sense to me. This is not going to make much sense to you. Florida Democrats refused to participate in the vote to confirm Joseph Lopato. That made sense. They should not confirm this guy. Okay, this is a Governor DeSantis pick for the Surgeon General position in their state. It's a hot mess. Let's just go to the video. We don't feel that we're getting any answers met. And we know that there is a long agenda today with a lot of bills. And so um, the Florida Senate Democrats are in this committee now are going to abstain, walk out, and come back when we have more business to, to, to retend. <laughs> we're going to move on to. <laughs> okay, there's a reason they did this, and you need to see the reason why they did it. Now, because they represent a small section of that committee, their walkout really doesn't have much consequence. Um, but this is what it was over here it is I believe that vaccines in fighting against a pandemic like covid-19 are effective so again i would i would say that that the um, the question is a scientific one and it's one that is answered with data so um, so the uh, the the question ref- the question is informed by um, data on you know on specific outcomes and specific specific therapies. So that's I, that's the uh, that's the scientific question. Mr. Chair, uh, just a couple more follow ups. Just a yes or no. Do vaccines work in fighting against COVID nineteen? Yes or no? I, I as a scientist, you know, I I I I, I am compelled to answer the scientific question, and I'd be happy to answer. Any specific scientific question that you have uh, related to vaccines and COVID-19? Scientifically, do vaccines does the do the vaccines work against preventing COVID-19? Yes or no? And, you know, it, it, yes or no questions are are not that uh, that easy to find in science. Um, so I will. I understand. I think I I have better clarity about your your question at this point. I'm about to fall out my damn chair, (laughs) okay? This man wants this job so damn bad, and he knows good and damn well if he tells the truth, DeSantis will say, "Oh no, I withdraw the nomination." (laughs) Come on, brother, you don't need a paycheck that bad. You're well educated. Let's put let's put up his um education, his picture education. That's his picture. Um, Wake Forest degree in chemistry, magnum cum laude, Harvard Medical School. Uh, MD, PhD from Harvard University in health policy. The list goes on and on and on, all right? Okay, you mean to tell me you're a highly educated ass cannot answer a simple question about, hey, do vaccines work? Are they effective? Well, I don't know if they're effective, the science and the data, and then we go to Star Trek and we go to the Starship Enterprise, let's ask them. What? Have you all ever seen in your life a person in a professional interview capacity for a for a nomination in a high high impact position? Interview like that. Okay? Never. He still is going to get the job. They don't give a damn about his ability to answer simple questions. They don't care as long as as long as he's hand picked by DeSantis, we call that something in my community. I won't say it on television, but he is their guy, okay? And they don't care if he can answer simple questions. What he did in that moment is he proved he's willing to do their bidding, to carry their water. The sad thing is he understands all too well how this virus goes through communities, especially communities of color. He knows the misinformation has hurt in particular communities that don't have access to the same level of health care as others. Is he going to do anything about it? No, you know why, put his picture up. Here's why he's not going to do a damn thing about it. Because he only cares how he can benefit in the social structure where whiteness is the measure of power. That's it, as long as he can benefit personally. See what you're looking at right there? That's a bona fide sellout. Bona fide. All right? I tell his mama he'll sell out.
<laughs> Jackson, what are your thoughts on him? No, all them degrees and you still corny, all them accolades and you still a Come sucker. Come on, man. You know what I'm yeah. saying? You still a sucker. And you know, like he's just one of those guys, and you know, we all know him, especially in the you know, I, I in the centers of higher academia, you know, those people like, oh, I can't make a mistake. I have to have a perfect image, or else I'm gonna piss off a lot of white people, and then I'm not gonna <laughs> be able to make my place in the world. Or, oh, you know, what I'm saying he one of them guys, and he really just looks ridiculous, you know. And again, like you're gonna look back at this, and it's like all this for Ron DeSantis, all this for, for Ron DeSantis, right? All this for the Republican legacy. Like, what's your job going to be like? You're going to get this job and you're just going to be on eggshells permanently. Yep. And all for what? All for what? You still going to be a sucker and you still going to be corny. You know what I'm but saying? Yep. So, Well said, brother.